What do you mean it's your guys' birthday? I mean that it's the 17th anniversary of the day that I was born. Ugh. No, I know what it means to be someone's birthday. But why didn't you say something beforehand? Now I feel bad for not knowing. Don't feel bad about it, Suki-sama. No one told you. We couldn't expect you to have known. After all, you are always so busy with your studies. I don't see why I should be treated so differently just because it's my birthday anyways. Oh yeah, cause you're always special. Exactly! Oh. My. Fucking. God. Well, uh, I'll leave you two to it then. Hey, wait. You're not going to join us? Isn't it your birthday too? I think I'm going to step outside. Kazashi... She, she doesn't celebrate her birthday. No one ever told her when it was in the first place. We only know at this point because of common sense. What? It's a long and complicated story. I bet. Oh, jeez. It's a downpour. Those random July showers. Wait, but isn't Kazashi out there? She'll come back if she wants to. She's not a dog that can't let herself in. True. I'm just surprised you aren't trying to get her to come back in. If you really are so concerned about Kazashi, you can go check on her. <sighs> I'm going to trust that you know her well enough to know that she's okay. Well, of course I do. But I do have a question for you. Yes? <laughs> Was there anything that you wanted for your birthday? Anything? Yeah, I know I don't have that much money, and you could pretty much have anything that you wanted because your family's wealth, but perhaps there's something I could give you that's a little more personal? How about a kiss? <laughs> oh my gosh, you can't be serious. Of course you'd say that. Just because it's something that I want doesn't mean you actually have to give it to me, darling. Darling, huh? It'd only be a kiss on the cheek. I am a lady after all. Oh, but it's really alright. I don't need anything for my birthday. A kiss on the cheek is really all that you want, though. I'm curious. Are you gay? Darling... I think most people at our school is queer in some way or another. I just like pretty things. <laughs> you like pretty things and yet you keep me around? You better have your eyes checked. You are a looker, but you have a beautiful soul. Your soul radiates with beauty as well. My, you have some soft lips. You're rather gentle for a tall girl. Har har, I'm not Nishimura. Now she's a giant. <laughs> well, I think you're a cute mini giant. That's an oxymoron. <laughs> Thank you for the gift, Suki-chan. Happy birthday, Katsu-chan. Thanks for having me. Though I couldn't care too much about birthday celebrations, this is turning out to be a very nice one. No need to be shy. You can hold me back. This all right? Acceptable. 
You should put your other arm around me too. Alright, I won't make a fuss. So, birthday girl, any plans for the big day? No, Suki-chan. I thought I made that clear. Nothing at all? Nothing. Something seems to be a bit off. Is she worried about Kazashi after all? Something seems to be a bit off. Is she worried about Kazashi after all? Nothing really feels different on my birthday. Are your parents going to take you out to celebrate later? Maybe host a dinner? My family isn't around right now. But even if they were, I don't want to celebrate my birthday when Kazashi's isn't being recognized as well. I guess that makes sense. Why don't we go check on her? If that's what you want to do, I'm interested in doing that. Let's go, shall we? Yes, let's. Kazane! Katsu? Suki? What are you two doing out here? You're going to get all wet. We came out here for you. I know you never celebrate your birthday, but it's never too late to start. Uh, that's sweet of you, but you didn't have to be concerned about me. You're getting soaked out here. You should come inside with us. That's alright, really. I'd love it if you'd come with me, but... It's your choice, Kaza-chan. I'll go in if you guys want me to. No, no, no. Go in if you want to, sweetheart. Uh, uh, I don't know what I want. Well, I'm going back inside. Care to join me, Suki? Give me a moment. I'd like to wait for Kazashi. Alright then, you two. Try not to catch a cold. Okay. I'm trusting you to take very good care of my dear sister. Got that, Yamauchi? Gucci, it's not that I don't appreciate the gesture, but you really didn't have to come out here with me. Huh? But I wanted to see you. Really? <sighs> so sorry about that. I think you're the first person in a long time that actually wanted to see me. What about Katsumi? She doesn't count. We are twins, after all. Fair enough. But honestly, what about your family? I don't really have any. I'm pretty much an orphan aside from Katsumi-sama. What? No way. But don't get me wrong. I love the Takahashis. It's just... I'm not their family. No matter how much I wish that I was. Kazashi. I really don't want to talk about this anymore. I'm sorry. Don't be. It sounds like a painful subject. Speaking of what you want, have you decided on what you want to do? Probably out in the rain where I belong. Like the stray dog that I am. 
Kazashi, you aren't a dog, and you don't belong in the rain. Thanks, Suki-sama. I appreciate it. But you don't believe it. I, I never said that! I didn't mean to make it seem like that! Don't worry. I know. One moment, Kazuchan. Huh? Well, I can't force you to come in, but can I stay out here with you? But you'll get all wet, Suki-sama! Well, that's why I have the umbrella. Ta-da! I'm glad. We'll just get over here and come under it with me. Uh, Suki, there might not be enough space for the both of us. Well, just get really close to me then. Thank you so much, Suki-sama. Please, Kazuchan, drop the Sama. What? Uh, uh, if that's what you really want. It's alright. You don't need to be so worried about touching me. But I'm all wet. <laughs> exactly. You're all wet. So let me make sure you don't get too cold. That's fine. I initiate after all. I should apologize for making you uncomfortable. You didn't make me feel uncomfortable. You've just made me feel really giddy. Thank you, Suki-chama. I'm super grateful that you stayed out here with me. Suki-chama, I am so glad you're back here again. I like you a lot, too. <laughs> I love your dress, by the way. It's super cute. Thank you. It makes me feel like a doll. Well, you're cuter than a doll. I think that Katsume is really worried about you. Really? Yeah, and maybe the two of us should go and join her. It is both of your guys' birthday after all, so the two of you should be celebrating together. Yeah, I think that'd be nice. Kazaane, Suki-chan, welcome back. Thank you, Katsusama. Come on down here, you silly girl. Eh? <laughs> Katsumi, be a little more gentle. Yes, yes, I will. Hey, now. I'm sorry. Am I being too invasive for you, darling? Sorta. Well, I mean, you could have at least asked or warned me that you were gonna do something like that. I was just so excited. Katsumi, 
I know, I know. But I'm so glad for you two. Us two. You seemed so chummy. I'm happy about that. You took care of her like I told you to. Thank you. Thank you, Tsuki-chama. You guys don't have to thank me. This has to be the best birthday I've ever had. <laughs> Agreed. Come on inside of me, Kazashi-chan. I don't want you to stay out in the rain. Huh? Oh, Suki-sama, you don't have to worry about me. Honest. Well, I want you to come in with me. Oh, all right. If that's what you want. Trust me, this will help avoid you getting sick. Thanks, but I have a strong immune system. Well, now you can get warm with me inside. Thanks. <laughs> 